Hi everyone, it's Lani and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a little different. I've never filmed a video like this before, but I wanted to do a first impressions, mini little review, lip swatch video on this right here. So I got this in my BoxyCharm. I don't even know if that was in focus, but yeah, I got this in my BoxyCharm last month. This is a half cake game changer, three lip fondants. I have never tried this brand before. I didn't swatch anything. I have never tried it so today I wanted to do a lip swatch video on these three so first of all packaging very very cute I don't know what these cost but where I I'll make sure I try to leave everything down below for you guys so as soon as you open it you get the three liquid lipsticks right here and the packaging super super cute so I'm gonna obviously start off with the lightest and then work my way to the darkest because <clears throat> I don't know if these are going to stain my lips. So I wanna make sure that everything stays true to color and I am not going to do any lip liner or anything like that. My lips are a little dry, so I did add a little chapstick. I'll get rid of it so it doesn't affect the way these things apply, these things, the way these lip products apply. So I'm going to do little swatches on the hand and then I'm going to work on my lips. The first one is a theme song and it is this color right here. It just looks like a really, really pretty. It looks like a pink. It doesn't look like a nudie pink. It just looks like a pink to me. So before that, we're going to smell all three of them because I want to know what they smell like and if they smell different. Oh, okay. So it has a very sweet scent. I can't really, okay, hold on. Okay, so this may sound a little crazy, but this smells like Jelly Bellies, the popcorn flavor. Is that, is that weird? I don't know, I that's what it smells like. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It has a nice little pointed doe foot applicator, slight point, sorry. And I'm just going to swatch this on my hand. I'm going to do a really, really big, thick, heavy swatch because I'm the worst at swatching. That was probably way too big because where are the other two going to fit? Already messed up. Anyways, so this is the color. It's just a really, really pretty kind of like mauve pink. So let me just, I want to see how much product I need to cover my lips. So we're just going to work off of this. And I have a small little mirror in front of me so I can really, really see what I'm doing. Oh, let me get rid of any of this chapstick off of my lips. Okay, so nothing on my lips except tissue residue. Okay, lip products. So this feels really good. Okay, so this feels really good. It's very hydrating. It's very moussey. It's very pigmented. I only needed to go in with one dip to app one dip application to cover my entire lips. It does have a very strong scent. I can still smell it on my lips. Kind of feel like like there's a little bit of a cooling sensation on my lips, but nothing overbearing at all, but it's very comfortable. I'm just gonna wait for it to like dry down so I can see what the texture dries down to, just dries down. Yeah, I actually really, really like this. I love the formula. It's very, very comfortable. It is not drying at all. If you're someone who doesn't like liquid lipsticks because it's so drying, this is going to, this is going to be a really, really good option for you. I definitely recommend the formula. So this brand, but yeah, it just, it just dries down to a matte powdery finish. No little transfer at all. Okay, so first shade I like, I'm gonna see, okay, so I have a baby wipe. I wanna see if this is really easy to remove. And if not, then I have makeup remover right here. So 
baby wipe. Let's see. Okay, so with the baby wipe, you do have to go in really, really aggressive and really hard, and it's still not getting everything off. So I'm gonna take a little bit of this Garnier micellar water just to remove it. Okay, moving on to the next shade. This is low key, and this looks like a deeper pink. This one kind of smells different. Yeah, this one smells different. It smells like tricks. The cereal. I don't know. Maybe I'm just not good at the way things smell, but that's what it smells like to me. Wow, this is beautiful. I'm trying not to do the biggest swatch because I want to make sure I have space on my hand for the next color. So that's the color right here. I'm gonna just do one full dip. Okay, so that's what this shade looks like, and I think it's a really, really beautiful shade. This is not a everyday go-to shade for me. I'm more of a pink, peachy, nude, nude lips type of girl. But I do really, really love this applicator. I think it just makes it really precise. So if you're someone that doesn't, if you're someone that doesn't like lip liners, then you necessarily don't need to use a lip liner with this because it gives you that really, really nice precision with that point. But I like that the the less brush you add onto your lips, the faster this just dries down. And it, I love, love the finish of this. I think it's so pretty and just so, so comfortable. I'm trying to figure out what, what it reminds me of. Oh, okay. So it reminds me of the NYX soft matte lip creams. The formula like it's just it's that comfortable so this is what low-key looks like okay last one we're swatching is this deep red which is Bordeaux and of course we're going to smell this and try to figure out what it smells like I don't know what this one smells like I don't know what this one smells like Okay, we're gonna skip on me as we're trying to guess what this smells like, and we're just gonna go on to the swatch. That's. I haven't worn red in a really, really long time, but that's a really, really beautiful deep red. Wow, that's so nice. Man, my lips are already so dry, and this is only, I've only done two swatches. This is so pretty. Oh my gosh. This is so pretty. This is really, really pretty. It's like, I don't, it looks like a deep, dark orange red, which I do really, really like. On my hands, it's not pulling as much orange as it is on the lips, but it's so, so pretty. Wow, this is really, really nice. This is, yeah. So I was not expecting to like these as much as I do. Honestly, when I saw them, I didn't, I didn't hate the colors, but they didn't really speak to me, but putting them on and swatching them, they're speaking to me. They're so pretty. The formula is incredible. I have no complaints whatsoever. These are just going to look so good on so many different skin tones. I just, 
I don't know, this red that I'm wearing right now, it's just not going with anything I have going on on my face, but this red is so, so pretty. So pretty. But okay, I would 100% recommend these for all of the reasons that I've listed in this video. So yeah, I'm gonna end this video here. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And actually, hold on, I think, I think I can find out how much, yes, I have the thing still. So these retail you for $32 for all three of them. So I, I had my little BoxyCharm little pamphlet and that's what the retail value says. So that's what I'm just passing on to you. But yes, I'm going to end this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.